Hello everyone, this is Jason with Engage VR YouTube channel. And here today we're gonna do an unboxing of the InReal Consumer Kit. Uh, here, what you see in front here. So I'm multitasking, I have uh, the camera in front and recording, but this is a brand new kit directly from Korea showing the InReal U plus 5G consumer kit. Uh, the consumer kit is only for Korean devices and was released in Korea for consumers. And we went ahead and purchased the actual glasses uh, for a couple reasons. One is the glasses are actually released to consumers in Korea. So we are curious as to uh, what the actual consumer or end product actually looked like uh, for consumers and what they would actually be using upon getting the kit and their actual devices and using the uh, LG network. Um, because we're in the States, so we won't be able to directly connect um, to the uh, LG store that they have set up but at least with the device or the consumer end device, we can get a, a kind of a gauge of where in real uh, direction for final consumer product and actually pushing it to market. So we're gonna go ahead and open it. Um, sorry for the, the multitasking here. Um, this camera setup is still kind of work in progress. Let's see if I can open it without messing up the box completely. How about how about we do it this way? We open it from here, from the bottom. Let's see if we can get this bad boy open. All right, so. Taking the plastic off here. It's a very nice uh, box set up. There's a little bit of information. If you wanna see there, the InReal light. It's the InReal with the U plus 5G. This is the actual consumer kit and actually unboxing. So let's take a look here. So, Looking inside the actual kit, consumer kit and setup, we see a case. This is very nice uh, product design and setup. Look at that, that's pretty straightforward, pretty cool. Um, let's see if there's some hidden items in here before we open it. Let's leave that there, really portable. Check that out. We won't open it right away. Let's take a look and see. Uh, it seems to be some additional items in here. Let's take a look and see what these items are. Oh, look at that. That is the VR uh, blockage for the actual lenses here. So you can actually cover to be in VR mode. Shade attachable, attach on. And it looks like we have to attach the actual glasses to it and the different nose guards here. Let's go ahead and set that down. Let's take a look at this here. This might be some Instructional guides uh, showing you that's the actual QR code to scan for the one store. There's the quick start guide and there is an actual cloth to keep our lenses here clean and it says it's got some text on here. Rule clean your mixed reality. Yes. 
Okay, so quick start guide, consumer policy, and some in real stickers, which is pretty dope. So we'll put these to use. We'll set that over there. Uh, let's take a look at the quick start guide. Now, uh, something you might be wondering or have some questions on is the if this is the consumer glasses and for Korea only what phone devices would actually work for this so the phone devices at least from other developers and things that we've actually heard is the 8 plus 7t the 1 plus 8t um, also heard possible the Galaxy S9 would possibly work. We haven't confirmed that. And obviously the Galaxy S20 and the S20 Ultra, uh, which is 5G, uh, Ultra Plus 5G, one of the two. Um, for us in general, because this device is in partnership with LG, it is assigned to only work with those devices and their particular app store uh, which shows the Nebula OS on it. Um, for us, we wanted to kind of just get a feel of what the consumers actually will have and kind of what things will look like. Now, there's some additional experiments that we want to do on our own with the actual glasses. Um, and maybe we'll make some additional videos for that. But we just wanted to share the opening of Consumer Kit. And in the quick start guide here, you can see uh, the in real light glasses, the VR cover, lens frame, nose pads, uh, it's showing you photo video camera, capture camera, spatial computing cameras, which is two. Uh, there's the microphones and the spatial sound speakers, which are actually over the ears. Um, so pretty straightforward. Let's see. Uh, there's kind of a walkthrough on how to use the InReal uh, with your phone and the uh, Nebula uh, when you plug in and how things will actually start working right away. Kind of a walkthrough on the application. You kind of see that there. Attach the VR cover to get best immersive video watching. So if you want to do full VR mode, uh, you can actually do that, and there's a little bit more details there. Now, um, you know, a lot of people have asked for the glasses to kind of work in the States and, you know, see some other things um, in regards to, you know, phones and, you know, the excitement of eventually being released in the U.S. Now, you know, there was rumors and talks of this being released in December. Um, for U.S. consumer, we don't know, you know, how true or detailed that actually is, um, but we wanted to kind of get a jump run and feel what the consumers actually received in Korea. Um, so we're going to go ahead and open the main part of the product, which is, you know, the actual glasses themselves, so we can actually see what it looks like. And here you see in real with U plus 5G. Let's go ahead and open. So this is the first time we're opening it. And look here. So we actually have the glasses. So taking a look at this initially uh, from the beginning here, you're seeing the black design. We're gonna go ahead and I kind of really like this design. And put some really good effort into it. We're gonna go ahead and get the glasses out here with the actual cable. We'll set that there. So there you have it, the uh, in real consumer edition of the actual glasses themselves. Very lightweight. Um, we did get to try them on at CES this year, actually, in 2020. 
uh, January, so we, we did get to try. We didn't try uh, these in particular, even though they were black. Um, not sure how far off or different these are in comparison to um, the CES versions. And let's get the camera here. So take a look at the glasses here. And real with U, U plus 5G. Very lightweight. And the front with the actual sensors. Um, the spatial cameras and the regular photo cameras. And there you have it. So the cable, which actually is type C, uh, to plug in. And basically you plug into your phone to actually start connecting to it. Um, so what we're gonna do is try to experiment with a couple things uh, with the actual glasses, but this is the consumer kit. A very good start on InRail's behalf of you know delivering and actually getting it out to consumers. Um, we've seen a little bit of consumers actually post a couple things here and there. Um, in our case, we're really excited to try to get applications on the platform and into the marketplace uh, for consumers to actually try out things. So you may want to kind of stay in tune with us. Um, subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Be sure to hit that like button, like and subscribe. Um, if questions, comments, feel free to post. Um, but yeah, we think this is really nice. Um, so this was the unboxing of the InReal Consumer Kit um, released in Korea. And we'll try to get more updates soon. Thank you for watching.